Oh, too good to be true. How about yourself? I know. Congrats on everything. Thank you. So, what can you tell me? Like, for the scenes, when you see the scenes going on, and how do you comp make the music? Well, uh, for a show, uh, for processing a show like Stitchers, uh, which is so so different. I mean, they look they're they're hacking into the brains of recently dead people. So you know, it's kind of wild. Sort of, it's it's uh, it's high techy, but it's organic at the same time because you're into a living being. I mean, a, well, a formerly living being. So, and it's you know, it, it it forces you to think outside of your comfort zone and think outside of where you're normally uh, working from. And uh, we put together things that are really interesting sound designs with, with uh, a mixed with traditional uh, orchestral sounds, and uh, I think it's kind of fun. I'll be interested to see how people uh, enjoy it by itself in a in a uh, concert setting. Well, the show is very urban, and it has like um, uh, not, like it's urban and it's contemporary, like now. Yes. Because there's a club scene, there's all these like scenes yeah. going on. I watch the show, so I love the show. <laughs> and so, when you're get watching the scenes, do you just kind of like pick and choose based on their personality, or based on what the, how the scene is going? Because each character has their own kind of personality. Both. It's it's both the the character's personality and when what's going on at that moment on the uh, on camera. And uh, I just let that guy be my guide and see what's happening. And the brilliant. Uh, the brilliant direction of the uh, showrunner uh, Jeff Schechter, who is always spot on with how he wants. He knows what he wants the music to feel like, and he's really great at communicating that with me. So, well, as an artist, what's imp how is music important to move the scene along? Well, you know, as I always tell people, you know, that's the way you know what to feel is the music. And I mean, a dark. A camera going down a dark hallway is not scary, but when the music comes in, you know, we all know what's <laughs> We know what's going to happen, so, you know. Well, everyone is obsessed with the love scenes. Maybe Camston and, and uh, Anna Karen, uh, Kana is now in, on now the show. There's some yeah, there's some love. Um, how do you pr play the music according to the love scenes going on, especially for the fans who are obsessed with it? Yeah, well, that was a big deal. We, uh, with Cameron and uh, Kirsten, we did both uh, an, an orchestral score uh, a love theme as well as there's a particular song that led up to their first kiss. And uh, so, but they have a love theme, and uh, the, several of the other characters have their own love themes, and we have to differentiate between the all, all three of them. So it's going to be a lot of love and Stitcherbill <laughs> this year. <laughs> and can we hope for a musical episode, maybe that you could compose and, and write? You know something I've I've heard tales of something like that, and because the uh, the the yeah the cast is really talented music wise, so I'd really look forward to uh, doing that. You know, it'd be fun. Okay, thank you so much, and congrats for tonight too as well. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so